Kira and welcome to the Medicine and Clinical Skin Rules module. Uh, the learning intentions of the slideshow are that you have knowledge of the structure of the module, knowledge of the assessment, knowledge of the observed structured clinical examination, OSCE, knowledge of the expectations of the module and knowledge of who to contact if there are questions. The module structure is 11 weeks. The first week is with the Pacific module and other tutorials and then two five-week sections. Some learning activities span the whole 11 weeks. I'm the overall convener, Mark Weatherall, and our module administrator contact is as on the slide. One of the five-week attachments is with either Hutt or Kenny Peru Hospital and you'll be assigned to clinical teams at either of those hospitals. You meet there on the first Monday of the module to meet the clinical teams and there is an expectation you attend on Friday mornings when there are no other activities scheduled. The main assessment for these are four case histories according to the pro forma on Moodle. In the clinical specialty five week attachment you'll be doing gastroenterology clinics and procedures, neurology clinics and the stroke service and endocrinology teaching clinics. Common teaching across the module are in the neurology, gastroenterology and endocrinology aspects of the run in the first week and on a Friday across the full 11 weeks. Tutorials in the geriatric medicine run are in the five weeks when you're attached to the subspecialties in Wellington. Timetables for all these activities are on Moodle. In terms of the module assessment, this can be pass, potential distinction, conditional pass, incomplete or fail. You need to pass each component and these include MCQs in gastroenterology, endocrinology, geriatric medicine, each of the four case histories and a pass in the OSCE. A potential distinction is an A- grade for equally weighted sum of the four components. And conditional pass means that one or more of the assessments needs to be passed. Incomplete usually means not completed due to illness or exceptional circumstances. Completion of a component can be by arrangement with the module administrator. The OSCE is on the Friday afternoon of week 11 in the Department of Medicine. There are three stations and these are taking an actor's blood pressure with a manual sphygmomanometer, doing an actor's upper limb reflexes and power and participating in a gastroenterology history or information with an actor. Potential distinction is rated in this if there's potential distinction in two or more stations. In terms of expectations and questions, you are expected to attend all scheduled activities and tutorials. If you are unwell or need to be absent for another reason, please complete the appropriate form and let the module administrator know. Other questions are contact the module administrator or mark Weatherall with our emails on the slide. Thank you and we look forward to seeing you on the module.